What's up guys, Duncan James back for another video and in this video it's going to be hard to explain so pretty much if you haven't went to see my other two parts go check it out. So pretty much my dad went on his second trip about and the engine is gone. It deleted itself. I don't know. He said it was bad. So he didn't want to change the engine. So pretty much this is the truck that I made two parts on. He took the cab and put it right there onto the 2016 frame. This is the old cab to the 2016. And he put it on the 2016 frame. Pretty much my first video, if you guys check that out, you, you would hear me say that there's a chance that we might replace the cabs, replace the cabs to this frame. We finally did it because this engine just, I don't know what was wrong with it, but it just didn't work out. So pretty much, yeah, this is the DD15 2012 Freightliner Cascadia that I'll make two parts on. It's all disassembled. This is just the frame. The cab's over there. My dad's doing some tire work right now. And all of this, this tube, everything is going up for parts. So this right here is the cab that was on that one with the pole sticking up and but this one we didn't change the engine so it is still the same engine this is not the same engine it's a little bit different engine because it was sitting on the 2016 one so technically the engine is 2016 but the cab is still 2012 this is the same hood from the thing bumper everything we just replaced everything pretty much from that frame, we just stripped everything and put it on this frame. My dad in the back over here, he's changing these tires because this is from the old frame. And from the old frame, some of these tires aren't good. You see right here, there's like a chunk out of them from somewhere. Like minor stuff, you don't want that stuff when you're owner operator. Just want a decent truck, doesn't have to be brand new. I don't know which other tires. These tires look good. But yeah. I don't really need to show you guys inside, but I will anyways because you guys already seen it. Because this is the same exact cab as you could see but on the 2016 frame. This is a truck started. And this this uh, cabin for parts because there's a whole back part and then a whole side part with clean door everything all right so look if you don't know the backstory of this thing this frame came with that cab from IAA and go check out my first video I think I put how much I bought it for and this cab was on that frame so and this was from Copart I think and I didn't do a video on this one, but the general damage was this and the cab was just completely gone. So we had to strip it. And at the time we thought we're gonna take this, like this was a fully loaded truck with the cab. We thought we we're gonna take this cab and put it on the 2016 frame right away. But we're like, why would we do that? Because it's still a good engine as we thought. And then he went on a couple trips and the engine's gone. As you can see in the 2016 cab, everything's just trash. This thing is just, I don't know, maybe for parts or something. But this thing for sure, I'm gonna be selling it for parts. Like, look at these two diesel tanks. Perfectly good, those could sell. This thing, even this exhaust pipe. These, like, the little stuff, you know, like this stuff. And I don't know if we're gonna be selling the tires, but if you guys have this type of truck, a Cascadia Evolution, just hit me up. I'll put my email down below. If you guys need anything see like the radiator and everything is good and condenser is good my dad already took off the back wheels all four of them he's going to be changing these because all of them are stripped as you can see all this on all four of them 
And I'm gonna be selling a couple of these tires. As I said, go check my uh, email out in the description. This was just a little short video, ex me explaining what happened to the truck so you guys don't get left hang, you know? So you guys know what's up. So this truck is gonna be not operating anymore, obviously, it doesn't have a cab. But the cab, the frame that this truck, the cab went with is right there and that's gonna be the operator and that's a completely new engine so that's going to be very good and we tested that engine it started right up and everything's good so it went from this to this Told myself to push and never stop I've been stressed out Watching both these hands around the clock With my eyes wide Trying to get the panorama shot Whole world getting blurry to me Answers getting lost So I watch my back and keep it moving to the front And remember that the world's yours Do it how you want You've been waiting here for too long Think it's time for you to move on Realize that there's real lies And these real times will be strong I've been waiting all my life And it was right before all right guys that's going to be the end of this video and in this video i was just showing you guys what happened so you guys are up to date and pretty much at the end of this video showed you guys everything that happened it's pretty much it duck and james out